Hey, Stephen McNelly here. Uh, got a Phil Line Pro Series uh, backpack here, and we're just gonna go over what we put in it around here as a typical whitetail pack. Everything you see in this pack, you can get at your local Rural King. I literally could spend all day and fill up a bunch of shopping carts. This is a top load pack, got a little roll down here. Uh, it's got a little compartment up here. It's kind of where I put my little stuff or sharp stuff, things I'm probably gonna get into. Uh, got our nose jam or wax stick. Always gotta worry about scent control. That can jam the deer's nose. Got Gerber, multi-tool. Always gotta have this. You never know what's gonna break, tear up. Tree stand, you gotta tighten the screw on. Uh, whatever, on a rifle scope, you got it all right here in your little multi-tool. Got a real tree easy saw. Always got to cut limbs out of the way. Always got to make adjustments in the deer woods. Flag and tape, mark stands, mark a deer, bright eyes to mark it for in the morning. Uh, good old trusty buck pocket knife. So whenever we do uh, harvest something, we can make plenty of gut piles with it. It's got side pockets here. I keep my aerosols in one side. Got, once again, got our nose jammer spray here. And then also early season in Georgia and most of the south, you're gonna need some sort of insect repellent. Always gotta have you a good cushion. This is a thermos seat. Comes with, already comes with a little uh, D clip here or carabiner. You can clip to the outside. It's heated. You know, you know how in the cold mornings that graded metal, man, it make you cold all over. But uh, that's a good soft cushion. Real tree edge pattern on the outside. Outside of the pack here, we got two straps here. We got a reversible vest here. Uh, that way, if you ever forget your orange vest, you can turn it inside out during rifle season or if you're bow hunting, got you a good. Uh, best for early mornings, cool evenings. Got another uh, outside pack here. I keep all my Tink 69 uh, attractants in here. These are uh, trail drags I haven't used yet. Uh, I try to keep it centrally located in somewhere. That way in case it, if it busts or whatever, it don't ruin everything in your backpack, just one side. Uh, got two different kinds here. Got the one, the plastic bottle squirting, and you got the old glass bottle original. Gloves and a head net. I don't know how many head nets I've gone through in my hunting career, but it's always good to have one in there and gloves, use them, you know, for everything. Water bottle or coffee mug, extra batteries. Uh, you don't want to go in the woods and have your flashlights go out. And we'll get to that. I always carry extra batteries, both sizes, because once you have one, you're going to need the other. So carry both of them in there. Flashlight, got a good tracking light, headlamp, Probably my number one thing I will not go to the woods without is a windicator because if you ain't got the right wind, you ain't killing that buck you're after. Late season, hand warmers, always bring extras. Gut and gloves, always nice. Kill something and you got dinner that night, you won't get it all over you or on your hands where you can't get the smell off. Pull up rope, a paracord, I always carry some paracord or rope with me and I cut it to the length I need it because you can use this for everything. I've used it to tie back muscadine vines to pull it out of the way but also keep my cover up in the tree you can use this to tie off extra gear make a grunt call lanyard if, you, if yours breaks i mean there's endless resources for this so i always leave a whole roll in there and i cut it to what i need most packs come with a water bladder a uh, little sleeve for it that's where i put all my easy hangers because that way they don't rattle around and make noise as you're walking uh, we got the three arm two arm little guy for your backpack the cool thing about this field line backpack is it's got this front pouch right here that holds my essentials, my Bushnell binoculars and my Bushnell rangefinder. And finally, for gun season, I keep my ammo in this top pouch. The last thing in the main compartment, and, and can be argued, but I think is the most important thing, is snacks. Sunflower seeds to go past some long hours and not see nothing. And of course, some protein, so when you're really hungry, it'll get you by till you get home to get that grandma soup. Once again, this is about everything I carry in the woods with me on my normal whitetail hunting backpack. And uh, a hunting backpack, in my opinion, is invaluable. Um, not just for you, but in case you're taking kids, your wife, whatever. But uh, like I said, you can find all this at your local Rural King, and they'll get you ready for the deer season.